how are you? Here I am trying to have a bath, but obviously mm, my cat has to be in the middle. Anyway, the bath is pretty much to be able to remove all my tan from my last comb because obviously in eight days I need to have it again and it needs to be even, like my skin needs to be the same color otherwise it's gonna look terrible. So here I am, I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna prepare this little mix of bicarbonate of soda and my 0% gel so I can scrub the hell out of my tan. I'm gonna put it in this lush empty bottle and then I'm gonna put one of these in my bath to relax a little bit which I need because What is Shadow? Shadow? What do Well, as I was saying, um, I need to rest because my body is not used to like all of the posing and then straight away I start like training heavy again for this other competition so it's a bit tired, my back hurts so much so yeah, I need a rest have a bath, drink my green tea, and hello, that's... how are you? So, we are now on Tuesday, there is only five days left to compete and I have just um, weighed myself this morning, I did the whole scan um, I'll try to put it like around here and it's pretty good and very consistent with Friday That is the last time that I scanned myself. Actually, the readings are pretty good It's very similar to what it was close to stage weight and stage physique in my previous comp so Things are going great. I am really getting excited now for competition I've got already my tanning appointment, I'm already thinking about makeup because this time I'm going to do the makeup myself. Nails, I think I'm just going to keep these ones. Um, they don't look too bad. So I think I'm going to cancel the appointment that I have for my nails. Uh, because I mean, I don't really want to spend that much money on this competition. Um, lashes, I'm getting them done on Friday again because well, some fail because removing that makeup from competition was difficult. I had to use a lot of like oil-based makeup remover which is not good for the glue for the lashes so loads of them fell off so getting them redone again and yes three more days of work at the office in Cambridge and then Friday working from home so it's good, relaxed. Saturday we will be driving down to Hayes um, which is close to Heathrow and that's where the competition is taking place, getting my tan on, on Saturday, and then, yeah, competition on Sunday. I'm also very excited for carb loading, which starts Thursday. So Thursday is going to be the main one, then Friday a little bit, then Sunday, Saturday nothing, of nothing, of nothing, of course. And then Saturday, we'll see how we look, because I think feeling like the last few days that I'm too skinny that I'm too bony just to say like I can see my bones so I don't know good morning YouTube how are you all today marks four no this is eight four days out from the British finals it is really exciting um, so I figured I'm gonna talk to you while I'm driving as I usually do just because Yeah, it's easy for me to do it now to make sure that I don't forget um, I have an hour to go to work a whole hour um, Car journey, so I yeah, I figured this is the best thing um, I can talk to you while I drive and I don't get bored. Yeah, win-win Anyway, as I was saying today marks four days out from the British finals and Operation Beauty has started. What does that mean? Well, basically it means that 
I am not going to wear any makeup whatsoever until show day. The reason why I'm doing this, it is because on show day I'm going to wear so much makeup during the whole day. I'm going to be under really, really strong lights and my skin is going to suffer. Therefore, I don't want to, yeah, damage my skin during these next few days. I want my skin to breathe, to feel relaxed and yeah, and just to, you know, give it a break. Give it a break because Sunday is gonna be a hard day for it. My poor little skin. So, yes, we're giving it a rest. And then the next few days, now it's like exfoliating like crazy. Although I've been doing it the past few days to try to get this Oompa Loompa tan off my skin, which, yeah, it's off. Um, sorry for all of the movement, but obviously the roads here in the UK are not the best roads ever, so this happens. Um, then Friday is gonna be lashes, shaving, no nails. At the end I cancel my nail appointment because they are pretty good actually, so I'm not gonna have them done. It's okay, I think they're gonna be good for show day checking with the coaches today everything is looking great and then we are starting tomorrow the dandelion root so today we start with the vitamin c tablets and then tomorrow we're starting to introduce apart from the vitamin c the dandelion root uh, capsules it's gonna be fun we're gonna start seeing results because it is crazy how much how much your body changes when you are doing this whole water loading thing and just like, you know, getting rid of all of the excess water. Crazy. I was like so amazed on my first show that I cannot wait to see how I look in this show because it's been only two weeks since the last one. So hopefully my physique will be a bit better. It's not gonna be loads better because with two weeks there is not much you can do, but a little bit better, yes. So exciting. Anyway, now on my way to work. Tomorrow is car load day, and I am going to film it. And I'm going to show you what I'm having. It's not massive. It's not loads because, as you know, well, you don't know because I haven't told you. But I was doing um, keto, so not many carbs. So to me, what I'm going to have tomorrow, it's loads of carbs. <laughs> For other people it might not seem like it, but to me it's loads, so I'm really happy. Anyway, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Morning. We are three days out and today it is carb load day. Yes. So this is how we are looking at the moment. Some Abby. Which is great. Yes! Hello again! Well, we've just finished the first session of the last day of cardio before show day. And I'm gonna tell you a little bit about what I'm going to eat today during my carb load. And I'm gonna insert clips here about the food so you can see it pretty much. So, what we have today for breakfast is two whole eggs and three egg whites. The eggs I do them poached. Sometimes I do them fried but mm, now I just feel to have them poached. Uh, and then the egg whites I do them in an omelette and I put a little bit of garlic salt on top and then I eat it. Then as a midday snack we have white fish with some veggies. In this case is hake with peas and a little bit of garlic salt of course because otherwise Mm, it's not nice, it doesn't taste good. After that, for lunch, what I have is usually chicken salad because it has to be 125 grams of chicken with some veggies. So in this case, I do salad with a little bit of tomatoes as well and garlic salt and apple cider vinegar. That is pretty much my lunch and it has been my lunch for the past four weeks, if 
I remember correctly. Because I feel it, uh, for some reason I just like it because it's kind of like crunchy and it makes me feel fuller for some reason. So yeah, that's why I decided to have chicken salad. After that, we have chicken with 100 grams of white potatoes, these baby potatoes. Mmm, yummy. And of course, garlic salt. Yes, you got it. <laughs> then is the most exciting part of the day the pre-workout as a pre-workout what i'm having is 50 grams of oats a banana and some coconut oil so as you know i used to have the banana and coconut oil before my workouts so now i'm adding 50 grams of oats and it's life it's amazing and i usually have it in a container but today i brought a proper bowl because my oats deserve a proper bowl it's a ritual they need to be in a bowl it's way better taste nicer so yes that's why i'm having it in a bowl in the car on the way to the gym and then as a post workout and pretty much the last meal of the day it's going to be 125 grams of a uh, ground turkey with some garlic salt and a little bit of Tabasco just you know to spice it up a little bit and then I have a crumpet and 10 grams of yeah something that I forgot to tell you I'm just taking advantage of there is no one in the office yet is about the the water um, that we're doing the water thing that we're doing so as I say, yesterday we started with two tablets of vitamin C and today we have another two tablets of vitamin C and then two capsules of dandelion root extract in the breakfast, lunch and dinner um, to just, you know, help get rid of all of that extra water in the belly. Yes. <laughs> and tomorrow we do the same. And then Saturday, this time Saturday, will be three tablets of vitamin C. Mm. 